and I am going to explain you advanced clinical SAS interview question number three. If you have an experience in Adam, then the interviewer may ask you the questions like what is LOCF and what is WOCF. LOCF is nothing but the last observation carry forward and WOCF is nothing but the worst observation carry forward. These are the methods which comes under the variable called D type. And let's see what is LOCF and what is WOCF. <coughs> if you see here, the baseline week one, week two, week three, week four visits are present. As per the protocol, they plan four visits uh, apart from the baseline, and the subject may not come to the attend the week four visit. That time, what happened? The aval value is missing. So, what the statistician is suggested to take the last observed value which belongs to week 3 then populate the same aval value into the week 4 so here here you see the aval 135 value were populated in week 4 no, nothing but we are taking the last observed observation we are carry forwarding to the next visit in the same way the VS sequence and Aval value we are uh, carry forwarding and the visit also we are carry forwarding. Just look at this slide, you can understand what happened. The observation which was observed in the last visit, just we carry forward to the our next visit because the subject was not attended the particular visit. This is called LOCF. In case of the WOCF, if you see in the post baseline met, mm, me, me, best baseline values nothing but up, apart from the baseline week 1 2 3 and 4 here if 130 is the worst value so just we are carry forwarding this worst values to this week 4 here you can see the week to also carry forwarding the VS sequence 79 is carry forward worst observation carry forward is nothing but the worst value which is present during the post baseline value just we are carry forwarding to the particular visits if the statistician suggested to derive the WOCF that time we need to populate the WOCF in detail method Thank you for watching my interview question videos. Please subscribe my channel so that I can post you more and more advanced clinical search questions. Thank you.